What's going on everybody? Lewis here. Um, hope you guys are doing all well. Uh, I just thought I'd bring you a little video about um, the whole situation as it currently is. Because I know you guys have been back and forth, back and forth, arguing and fighting with each other. Trying to find out what's actually been going on with the whole Heather and Jay situation. And um, uh, she involved me with it. She started talking about me in her video. About how I tried to spam report her and all this crap. And she, I don't know, she's just been talking bad about me. And she's been forever. That's the whole reason why I made my catfish video in the first place. I made it because in the past, she's... The, the first time I ever met her, here, I'll start from the beginning. The first time I ever met Heather was back in... I think it was April. I It was at like a house PvP party. I added her because I thought it was Heather Shadow Slinger. And I wanted to get more in touch with Duelist 101. And so I thought it was Heather Shadow Slinger. And I was like, okay, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to add you. And I'm going to try to talk to you and see what, what happens. Um, after talking for about two days, I found out it wasn't Heather Shadow Slinger, and I was like, okay, whatever, I'll just keep her at it, because why not? Um, so, I don't, then I never really talked to her, um, for a while, until, um, she made her channel. And when she made her channel, she started messaging me, and she was like, oh, um, do you think you can give me a shout-out? And she was, she was begging me for a shout-out, um, it was probably the most pathetic thing I've ever seen. She was literally sitting she was like begging me in the game messaging me oh can you please give me a shout out i'll do anything oh my god like, and, and he, she even had her friends asking me if i would give her a shout out i was like i don't give out shout outs like i just don't think that's it's right to give out shout outs maybe if, uh, if it's a close friend of mine or something but like I, I gave one for jay and chris i know that because yeah they're my friends um i gave one to blue and he made a channel yeah because he's my friend but the thing is like I, a shout out is like, you know, people. Pe I've been offered to pay for shout outs. My, I've been offered multiple times, uh, for like money, straight up cash, to, just for me to shout someone out and be like, yeah, go check out their channel. And I, I told her multiple times no, and she would not stop asking me. So eventually, I like removed her, and then I guess that's why she didn't like me, because I never gave her a shout. I guess that's why she initially didn't like me, because um, of that. And there was some uh, some tension with Ghost Rider, Dan, her old boyfriend, Daniel Ghost Rider. Um, he used to be he used to talk a lot of trash about me. Um, and he had, he posted a video, uh, that, that and like it was me and him one v one, and I said like good game, but he continued to talk trash. Like yeah, he beat me because he crowed on me like four times. Congrats. Um, and that's that's pretty much it. Like I we had a little bit of tension. It was nothing major. Until I got banned. When I got banned, I really didn't even talk to Heather. There was like, we didn't even talk, um, at all. And when I got banned, she made the videos, and I saw it. I was like, this is an obvious. She's obviously just trying to get views. She's trying to do whatever she can just to get views. And it was obvious. She had those are like probably still her most viewed videos to this day. What the hell is that? Is that the April Fool's mount? No, oh, it is. That's funny. <laughs> that's probably the best thing I've ever seen. But, um... Oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> but, anyway... Sorry about that. Um, Bingus, my brother, came in the room. Um, anyway, happy April Fool's Day, guys. Hope you, uh, yours is all going pretty well. Um, and I got some see good news. I am on band. JK, April Fool's Day. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> but, anyway, um... Back on the topic. I've, uh, I've worked down a few things that I'd like to say about the situation... And how I think, um, well, I just, some things I wanted to say to Heather herself, that, um, I can't really, I'm not just gonna, no, no, no one's in a match. But, um, I guess I'll just watch this one. But, yeah, there's a couple things I wanted to say, I guess, to you guys and to her, um, about her video, because she's lied, she lied a bunch in that video. And, um, wow, this match just ended, that's a joke. But, um. Yeah, let me, uh, let me start reading. So if you're coming here from her last video, then, uh, I want, want you guys to listen to this. Um, first off, you guys saw all the multiple screenshots from Jay, and, um, her screenshots of Jay saying that he's harassing her, and that he was talking all this crap, and blah 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 blah. You guys saw those screenshots from her video. Correct. And I'm gonna, now, I wanna point out that Heather's known to be a liar. She'll do anything to keep her sub count, and... Multiple people have told me this, that that's like the only thing she cares about, is her subs. How many subs she has and all that. Like, that's literally all she cares about, I was told. 
I wouldn't believe it. I mean, I wouldn't doubt it because everyone that does YouTube gets that, gets like that at some point. But um, I think she's a little overboard because she needs to just calm it down. Um, I and I honestly I wouldn't doubt if she made fake accounts just to screenshot the words that uh, she said to Jay because she what yeah we already know she lied about being old and she continues to and I'll talk about that later, but she's a pathological liar that's confirmed. Um, confirmed like. Uh, whatever, Half-Life 3. But, um, yeah, I, I wouldn't doubt that she made fake accounts to, um, just to get dirt on Jay, because Jay's actually a really nice guy, and he wouldn't harass her. And I know that for sure. And Jay's been in calls with me this whole time. Like, it's not like he's out doing stuff behind our backs. He's always talking to us, watching our matches, and chilling. It's not like he has time to even go and harass her. Um, and to pull up, bring up the fact that, uh, about her saying that, like, I... Uh, she always mentioned that I was like, uh, she kept saying, I don't even know how to put this, but she has nothing to do with me being banned. I guess that's what I wanted to say. She keeps saying, oh, uh, they only want me gone so Dakota can play. Like, no, that has nothing to do with it. She has nothing to do with me being banned. She, in the beginning, she said that she did get me banned. So I don't know where she keeps, uh coming up with that, oh, they want me banned so Dakota can play. Like, no, bitch, we want you gone because you're a lying pedophile psycho. That's why we want you gone. Um, and she is really messed up in the head, to be honest. If you think about it, what person steals some little girl's identity, gets caught about it, and then continues to lie and say that they never did, and then uses a different girl's pictures? That's even, that's so fucked up. I mean, why would you do that? Just, just give in. Yeah, we know you're fake. Just stop trying to hide it, and there's no point. Um, uh, next I want to put out, uh, she did, in fact, give out Jay's number. She said she didn't, she did. Multiple people have confirmed that she did, in fact, give out Jay's number in a group call, uh, with her and her minions. So they were on a chat call, I know they're always in a little call with each other, um, all Heather's and her little minions, uh, probably just talking mad shit, and, um, uh, yeah, she, uh, multiple people have told me that she did give that, her, uh, Jay's number out to all of her minions, and, uh, Kyle was one of those responsible for that. Um, next, no one in our fam reported her at all. That fake, no, or that, that, um, mute that she had, no, none of us did that. We haven't even seen her whiz, let alone reported her. She, that's one of the biggest lies I've heard all day. She said we all reported her, spam muted her. I wouldn't doubt that she also got her little minions, uh, to report herself. Uh, to make Jay look bad. I would not doubt that she reported herself to mute herself just to make Jay look bad. I would not doubt it in, this, in the least. Because that she would steep, stoop that low. And my only account I have right here is this one. It's a noob. His name is Lewis. Um, he's a life, level 2. But watch, I'll, I'll show you guys personally. I, I can't report people, even if I wanted to. Watch. I'll go out here, go to like some random person. Here, Alejandro Winter, the star. Can't even report, because why? I don't have a membership. I can't, I don't, I don't have a membership, but I do have open chat somehow, I don't know how. But, uh, yeah, so I can't even report even if I wanted to, so that's, we are, we're already disproving everything that she's even said. She's been pulling lies out of her ass forever. Um, and the chat about me DDoSing her was from September, and I'll tell you the story. We were all in a, I was doing a 3v3 tournament with Alia and my friend Sean, uh, Swift Hammer, I don't know if you guys know him, but I was doing a 3v3 tournament with them, and we went up against some kid named Kevin, uh, one of my old friends, we used to, I used to do tournaments with him, and I got disconnected during the match, and everyone was telling me, it's Heather, Heather disconnected you, Heather DDoSed you, I was like, okay, <coughs> that if she's gonna, if she wants to do that to me, then I'm just gonna do it right back, so the, the natural thing to do was me to go back at her instead of uh, me saying, oh, I'm just gonna sit here and keep getting DDoSed, no, I was going to retaliate, which I did, and, in fact, I did DDoS her. Yes, I, I'm not denying that. Um, I did DDoS Heather because she DDoSed me. It wasn't... I've never DDoSed anyone without a reason. I will give you that. And people say I DDoS all the time on this game. I never really DDoSed a lot. I did, I think, most, and the maximum is, like, seven times. And that was against uh, Marcus, who doesn't even play anymore. You guys don't even probably don't even know who Marcus is. Um, like five of the, the, of the seven DOSs were against Marcus because he used to, um, talk mad shit and try to DOS me himself. He got like a shitty ass booter and kept trying to ping me offline 
and I would, I, it would tell me like what IP is hitting me. I'd be like, this is ridiculous. I know it's, know it's you, Marcus. And I would just hit him back because he's trying to do it to me. It's not like I've never, I've never done anything like bad without a reason. I've never muted stuff. Like you guys used to say, oh, I used to spam report people, and that's why I got banned. Or I used to um, uh, cheat or whatever the hell you guys say. I used to hack people's accounts. I, don't, I didn't do any of that, but um, I did. The muting thing was also for a reason. I muted Tara Winner the one time because she came to my match, talked shit, and reported me. That's why I report, muted Tara Winner. And we're actually cool now. I have talked to her since. Uh, we don't have any problems anymore. So that's all in the past. But that's why I did that. Um, Night Spear, he used to try to DDoS me. And he would always come to my matches, talk shit. And he spam reported me multiple times to mute me. Um, so yeah, I did it to him. We also did it to James Sandrider. I don't know if you guys remember this. Back in, like, June, um, Jay was the one that did this. I, well, Jay, Jay was like, um, oh, he's talking mad And he, he was talking mad shit. I, I don't think he can DDoS. But he was talking a lot of shit. Um, and he was, like, juju spamming for the first time. No one even knew what juju spamming was. So, J I guess we were all joking around. And this is the first time we ever reported someone, by the way. Um, it was, uh, the guy that we're, we're talking about right now. Uh, what's his name? James Sandrider. So that he was the first person we ever reported. It was it was just because he was juju spamming, and no one even knew what it was. We were just like joking around. It was only a day mute. And yeah, I do kind of feel bad for reporting people. I did, but I never really did it without a reason. Because that guy became a major hater and turned into like a monster. But we've once again made up. So all these people that like really hated me back then are are I'm mostly friends with them. Even Jonathan Death Gem. Uh, some of you guys know Johnny Juju. I've talked to him since I've given Ben Ban, and we we're on a good note, so I'm I'm pretty fine. But I don't know about Heather. But uh, let's uh, bring this up. So I, yeah, I did DDoS her, uh, but that chat was from September, and uh, I haven't DDoSed anyone on this game since uh, since that last time I that I did on the game, which was Heather, back in August. that well that chat was from August uh, when I was doing the tournament. No, 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 my apologies. The DDoS was from August. The chat was from uh, September because I was messaging Jay about it. And um, uh, what I really want to point out is she's trying to bring up the past and old shit. Like, the DDoS thing was in the past. All the stuff she keeps saying about me is all in the past. About me being banned, it's in the past. She, that's all she does is bring up past shit. Just to try to get uh, people to ignore the fact and forget the fact that she did steal a teenager's pictures and identity and pretended to be them and even spam reported that girl's Facebook just to cover herself up and make herself not look fake. She spam reported some real girl's Facebook just because she because she stole her pictures. That's like me stealing Jay's pictures and or Jay's videos, uh, uploading them, saying they're mine and then reporting his channel so his gets taken down. Like it's crazy. It, it's something that no one should do. She, she's out of her mind if she's doing that. She's spam reporting people's uh, real-life Facebooks just because you got caught trying to steal their pictures. Like, that's sad. That's pathetic. Let's see if there's a good 2v2 going on. Uh, puppets. I guess this is a good match. Um, and I want to talk about the Twitch email now. Everyone that owns a Twitch account got that email because a bunch of people's switches got hacked and their passwords were changed etc. It was a big thing that happened on Twitch. No one ever changed her Twitch or, uh, or tried to hack her. She said Jay, she had that email because Jay tried to hack her. Jay had nothing to do with it. He Jay doesn't even go on Twitch. He has a Twitch because, yeah, I used to stream a lot. But, and he used to mod the chat. But besides that, he barely even goes on Twitch. And it's crazy that she would uh, say that. She, she, that's even more proof that she's so desperate to uh, find stuff against Jay. That's that's proof right there. That alone shows that she's so desperate to find stuff against Jay. And uh, people ask me, why? Like, why do you not like her? Why? Why do you want her off YouTube? Why, why don't you like this person? And this is why. She continues to lie and use other girls' pictures. That's insane. You've already been caught. You've already been exposed. Why do you continue to lie? There's no point to it. She's she literally still uses other girls' pictures. Before she was Ariana, now she's some blonde girl with blue eyes. Like no, we we already know. Uh, we don't probably don't know what she looks like because she won't ever put on her face cam um, because she's too she's too afraid of the truth. But 
Now she's pretending to be someone she's not again, which is it's crazy. And there's more enough there's more than enough proof provided by Anonymous Thrill. I don't know if you guys remember that. But Anonymous Thrill uh made multiple videos um proving that she's forty four and she's named Lisa. They made multiple videos proving that fact. And I think it's crazy that she still denies it. Doesn't make any sense. We've already, that's already been proven. And I want to mention her current boyfriend, Kyle. He's 12 years old. And I've been told this by multiple people. And this is not just one person or two people. This is like 8 to 10 people have told me that he is actually 12. And when she um, started going out with him, he changed his Skype's age from 12 to 14. Or 16 or something. It was one of those... It's one of those numbers. I don't have them added, so I wouldn't know. But he changed his Skype from his real age to a fake age when he started going out with Heather. And um, 12 and 44 don't really match unless you're trying to throw yourself in jail. So um, I hope Heather realizes that if she actually was um, dating this person in real life, she'd be in jail for... Um, I don't even know what the hell that charge is called, but it's not right. He's 12. You're ruining his mind. You're a 44-year-old woman who probably has a husband... It probably has kids. You should just stop and care about your family and stop caring so much about a game. It's crazy. You have a if you I, I, people have said that um her dad's always in the background. That's not her dad. That's her husband. We all know that. And she probably neglects her husband just to play the game. And she always says that oh her dad, or she said multiple times uh, that her dad's beating her or something. That's probably just her husband beating her. Probably because she won't get off whiz, and. It's cr it's crazy. I, she's definitely has something wrong with her head to be continuously stealing people's pictures and using them and saying they're her own. It is it's come to a point where it's not even funny anymore. It's not even cool. I don't even understand how people can believe her. They but then again, they she shows one screenshot. All of her little fanboys are like, "Oh my God, Heather, I believe you. I believe you. Go ahead, believe the liar. It's your fault. It's and at the end, it's only gonna hurt yourself because you're gonna be subscribed to someone who." Well, I saw all of her fans constantly and uses someone else's pictures. It's not right. Uh, identity theft is a crime, so I hope she just keeps that in mind. Um, whenever she makes her response video to this and to Jay's video, and I will link Jay's video in the description to go check it out, but whenever she does finally come around to making that response video where she probably makes more characters and more bullshit um, screenshots, I hope you guys will just uh, come back to this video and just, who who cares whatever she has to say? Whatever she has to say is completely irrelevant at this point. Because she did steal someone's pictures, and she continues to. And that's crazy. And she she's trying so, she's so desperate to get dirt on me and Jay that she's, she's bringing up stuff that happened seven, eight months ago. Like, put, it's all at rest. It's all done. It's all, like, get over it. Uh, she, she, she literally has nothing else to say. She's trying so hard to cover herself up. And she'll do anything too. But I hope you guys, um, I just wanted to enlighten you guys on my perspective. And, uh, tell you guys, um, what I know. Because I do know that I knew some stuff that other people didn't. And I hope you guys, uh, enjoy this video. Of just me telling you guys what I know about Heather. And, um, the kind of person she actually is. And, to be honest... Only thing I want her to do is just admit and just stop. Like, she just needs to stop harassing Jay with the phone number. She needs to stop giving out his number. She needs to apologize to Ariana. I want her to actually make a video and apologize to Ariana for stealing her identity. And I just want her to come out and be truthful. Just show... You don't even have to show someone who you are. I just want you to stop using young girls' pictures. Like, it's not attractive. Yeah, you can you can show me some young girl's picture and be like, yeah, that's me. That's not going to make me like you because the whole world already knows you're fake. So might as well, there's no point in even doing it. And that's all I want. I just want her to come clean and stop lying to everyone. Because it's actually unfair to her own fans who have to put up with her lying. And because they are her fans, they have to agree with her, I guess. And they have to agree with a lie, even if they know it's a lie. Because they like her videos. And that's pretty much all I had to say. Um... Hope you guys enjoyed. I put Jay's video in the description, like I said earlier. Go check it out, and um, I'll see you guys later. Peace.